What's up guys, it's Hat Physique and I'm back again with another banger, man. Y'all already know what it is, man. I got another one for y'all in December. You know what I'm saying? I'm running this shit up, bro. I'm running this shit up for y'all, man. Y'all already know what to do, man. But today, goddamn, we about to react to moments you wouldn't believe if not recorded, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? This is a little channel that I wanted to react to, you know what I'm saying? You know, I see a little bit of a little bit of interesting content on this uh channel. So I'ma just, you know, go ahead and check it out. You feel me? Just check this shit out, man. Let's get at it. Like and subscribe right now, or you're gonna have terrible luck for the next week. We live in a world where the craziest things happen. Planes fly too close to buildings, sinkholes appear out of nowhere, volcanoes Wait. erupt and send ash clouds hundreds of miles into the air. Some of these events are so extraordinary that you wouldn't normally believe them. You'd think that they can't happen, and any news of them occurring is simply fake news. When this happens, there's nothing more convincing than an actual video clip showing these extraordinary events going down. Oh, Here are some video clips depicting events that you would Let's never see what they got in store happen. for us, you know what I'm saying? Number 10. The Survival. Have you heard someone escaping a particularly horrendous situation in an unbelievable manner? Yeah, you probably nah. have. For example, someone may survive a terrible car accident without a scratch and in a manner you would not be inclined to believe. And the way the person surviving might be so crazy, so impossible, Word. that you would disbelieve it if you were to hear the story. But they be having like, some people be having some goddamn incredible luck, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? And it's just a blessing just to have that alone, you feel me? That's exactly what happened to these two Chinese school teachers in June of 2020. They were minding their business in their car and doing regular stuff when they found themselves being hit from behind by a trailer. Their vehicle was small and lightweight, so all it could do what was jut forward and crash underneath a cement truck. No, the small car oh, was now sandwiched nah. between the cement oh, truck my and the trailer God. behind it. Anyone oh what? my god, bro. If you survive that shit, man, you this video, you just lucky, bro. One conclusion and one conclusion alone. No one could have survived this. It was death, and that was all. But it wasn't. Both women in the front of the car were almost inexplicably saved from getting crushed to death. It was a real life miracle. Oh, hell nah, it. bro. Imagine living to tell the tale of such a ghastly you might accident. Well say you got stung. Number nine. Got down? The drifting tank. If you've watched any movie from the Fast and Furious franchise, you'd probably know lots about drifting and cars. Heck, you may have even seen a car drifting in real life. But do you know what you've never seen? You've never seen a military tank drifting. If anyone had what told you fuck? that a military these tank can drift, these niggas, out here, probably these niggas out here drifting tanks and shit? The fuck? I ain't even know tanks can goddamn drift. Like, that's crazy as hell. Just smack the person upside the head. As you can see, the road is wet, and the tank is moving at an incredible speed. The next thing you see is a swerve, a drift, and a crash. We just wonder if this video would give the makers a fast. I didn't even know tanks idea. move that fast though. That shit was moving Number fast. Eight. Shark fight. If I told you that someone had to tackle a shark while surfing, would you believe me? You almost certainly wouldn't. Surfing may be a dangerous sport, but it doesn't get so dangerous that surfers have to tackle sharks. That's what you'd say. Bro, like surfing, I feel like surfing is like the most dangerous sport, you know what I'm saying, that's out there, you know, cause you in the ocean, you know what I'm saying? And and you know what I'm saying, you just in the water, bro. Like you could drown at any moment, like and them them freaking ties is like Man, them ties is like seven, eight feet tall, ten feet tall, shit. And you may be remarkably wrong. Mick Fanning was surfing at the 2015 World Surfing Championships. When he suddenly fell off his surfboard, to his shock, and probably despair, he found that a shark had driven him off his surfboard and was trying to make him lunch. Oh, hell he struggled nah. with the shark and was able to swim back to shore without any injuries. Two years later, he was attacked by a shark again. Oh, and he decided, hell no. Nah. That's why you don't, that's why I say, bro, like, the ocean, like, bro, like, hell no. Like, humans is not even made to be in the fucking ocean in the first place, bro. Without any injuries. Like the hell, Two years bro? later, he was attacked by a shark again, and he decided that he would not surf anymore. Good decision. You should have been decided. That's Number it. Seven. 
parrot playing basketball. Parrots can be taught to do many things. They can be taught to speak, and some can even ask for food in human language. However, no one expects that they can be taught to play basketball, and yet this video proves that it can indeed happen. We guess the only question that remains is this. How much would you pay to watch an NBA parrot team? Number 6. The Hole in the Ground Imagine walking by, minding your own business, and suddenly sinking into a hole in the ground. This unknown Damn, woman bro, was low key, low key, that was her fault, bro. That was her fault, bro, because she, she not even paying attention, bro. Like, you telling me... The hole in the You ground. telling me your peripheral don't even let you see that you that right. these big ass Imagine walls walking is like by. like bro come on bro minding your own business and suddenly sinking into a hole that was in her fault all the this way, unknown woman was simply walking around minding her business and doing nothing extraordinary when a hole suddenly appeared in the side oh hell the nah. concrete melted bro that's like bro hell nah bro melted away and she sank feet first right into the hole hell no bro like that's why they those construction workers like y'all gotta y'all gotta know what y'all doing on these roads bro don't be trying to half-ass do shit you know what i'm saying like how y'all be doing some of these roads and shit like like some of these roads be fucked up you know what i'm saying y'all need to stop half-ass doing this shit like you know what i'm saying this shit could cause people their lives you feel me and she would have gone into it without anyone finding out, too. Thankfully, a taxi driver who was driving by at that exact moment saw the girl disappear into the hole and pulled over. He went over the hole and called out. When he received no answer, he went into the hole himself and found the girl unconscious. After a while, she became conscious and he called emergency services. Fire services were able to let down a ladder and help her climb out of the hole. Thank they were God, able to get the bro. taxi driver out, too. Thank God, bro. Number five. The coin that won't sink. Once a coin is thrown into the water, it sinks, and that's all about that. But what if we told you that that's not entirely true? That some coins may not sink, that a coin can float on water. You'd probably ask for proof, right? Well, we just happen to have video evidence of a coin floating. It so happens oh, that a lot yeah, of coins nah. can sometimes float. This is because they don't weigh too much. However, for these coins to float on water, they have to be placed in the water at a certain angle. You don't just throw them in and expect them to float. If you don't believe us, you can try it out yourself. Sure, I don't think. I don't think with like a U.S. Uh, coin or whatever. I don't think a U.S. coin will, you know what I'm saying, will uh will make a uh thing float. Bonnie and Clyde. This video you're about to watch is not only unbelievable, but it's also ridiculously funny. The premise of this video is this. There's a couple making trouble in a store. A policeman is called and he decided to arrest the couple. However, he has to arrest the man, who has nothing but cargo pants on first. This nigga running, but the man this is nigga running around the store like, what the hell, the bro? The cop ties him, tackles him. You gotta get the fuck out of the door like, bro, if you trying to be a uh, criminal, bro, you gotta be smart, bro. You can't be doing no stupid shit like that, bro. Like, you running around the store, nigga, like, nigga, go for the fucking door, bro. All sorts Thank of things, you, you try to go for the door, but shit, to back down. too late, He tries nah. to escape, but there's a big customer at the door stopping him from doing that. At this point, his girlfriend is visibly perturbed. She has no idea what to do anymore. She decides to go to the back of the store to find out if she can escape through that way. And at a point, it looks like she's indeed found a way. She soon disappears from the view of the camera, and you'd be forgiven to think damn. that she made her escape. However, just a few moments later, she crashes from damn, the ceiling into the shop. Head. By now, more cops were around to subdue and arrest her and her boyfriend. Damn, and that was the end of their the funny on but head. sorry little tale. Number three, robbery gone bad. Robbing is a crime, and it's a crime that's only carried out by the most hardened criminals. These criminals spend hours and maybe even days planning their heist. Sometimes they're successful. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. Like, not. I always Most wanted to have a the dream to do some shit dialogue. like that. Like, just go in the store and just bust all this shit and then just, you know what I'm saying, it's take successful. what I need. But I wouldn't just do that shit, you know what I'm saying? I wouldn't do that shit to harm it's nobody enough. or nothing like that. It's just something that I would, I would want to do just to have some fun or some shit like that. Most times, it depends on whether the person being robbed can get out of time when one in time. If they can, the cops may show up and catch the criminals. However, if they can't, the criminals may be able to get away from the scene in time. Now, the thing about criminals being caught is that it's rarely ever caught on camera. We hear about it, we know it happens, but we rarely ever see videos of it happening. However, videos like this show exactly what happens when criminals are caught. 
This group of criminals planned to use the fire escape to smuggle a bunch of expensive goods from Costco. As they were about to leave the store, the storekeeper dialed 911 and informed the cops of their plans. Bro, these niggas, the cops these niggas arrived stupid, on scene bro. and decided to wait in front like, of the fire escape for the cops. Like, y'all got caught red-handed, bro. Like, y'all niggas stupid as hell, bro. Dumb-ass criminals, bro. Dumb-ass criminals, bro. Them niggas been waiting at the door for y'all the whole time, bro. Look, this nigga got a fucking goddamn, what the fuck, a robot? Is that a fucking vacuum? So you telling me, is that a vacuum, bro? This man went in there just to steal a fucking vacuum. Bro, I'm done, bro. Niggas is stupid, bro. A fucking vacuum, bro. The cops also managed to apprehend the man in the thieves' getaway car. All a of this fucking, was caught on camera. A fucking vacuum, now bro. Now it's you time for today's best. To motherfucking... Man, that's... Man, y'all niggas stupid as hell, bro. Pick. Our best picture for today was sent in by a subscriber. If you come across a picture online and want to know more about it, you can send it in to us. Who knows, your picture may even feature in a future video. Number two. Lightning. Most people have heard of lightning yeah. striking a tree, a house, or something. In that fact, plays no guy. Is that one spot where locals say God, lightning has struck. Yeah. But it's hard to believe these tales of lightning striking somewhere because, well, how probable is it? Not very probable, you can say. The fact that these people never have evidence to prove that lightning indeed struck these places that they say makes it even worse. God, but here's damn. evidence of lightning I ain't even know lightning tree. do all that shit, not no. seen lightning decimating a tree before, well, now you can see one. This lightning completely yeah, divides shit. this tree, Hell no. into a shadow of itself. And in any case, the strike I live in no place that's like that, lightning bro. striking a human being and the person looking to tell the story. We know it happens, but not in this video. It's very yeah. unlikely, and even though it does happen, we'd really like to see evidence of it doing so. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. Man, show them some love, so, bro. Show them some love. Just go ahead leave a and like subscribe on this video, to that smash man. that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years you know of I'm amazing saying? luck. Try it. It really works. Number one, lion whisperer. Lions are probably the scariest animals. Hey, ever. shout out to the Leo. So scary, this, you, you know what I'm saying? It's something that they you the story showing the lions. You know what I'm saying? I'm a Leo. You feel me? But shout out to the Leos. You know what I'm saying? I just had to put that out there. Can be played with like dogs. We mean petting an actual lion like it's a friendly neighborhood lab. That's certainly crazy. But we have multiple videos of a man named Kevin Richardson doing exactly this. Oh, shit, this he shit talks to the lion. Shit, goddamn it. internet, goddamn. Goddamn. Grass with them. Generally treats them like you would treat a perfectly harmless dog. The only difference, of course, is that this is an actual lion, not some sort of stray pet. But does this make any difference to Kevin? He's comfortable no, not around. really. He doesn't care, and he has videos to prove. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the like. Lions, you know what I'm saying? Lions fuck with him, you know what I'm saying? That's all to it. Y'all see me goddamn react to moments you wouldn't believe if not recorded, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want more videos like this, then hit the like, you know what I'm saying? Comment if you got something, you know what I'm saying, to say about this video, uh, and subscribe, you know what I'm saying? Hit the post notification bell, stand, join the game. Have a Zeke, we out.